Welcome to another edition of What's Really Happening in the Edmonton Real Estate Market. My name is Gerhard Klan. I'm with Northern Lights Real Estate Consulting, providing real estate appraisals in the Edmonton area. Uh, this month, we are looking at the exciting new year, 2013, and what will happen in 2013. I always like to go to a couple of, of big sources, uh, CMHC and the Edmonton Realtors Association. Uh, they put a lot of work and into getting their statistics and, and looking at all the economic factors behind the market and what will drive the market. So what CMHC is predicting is that houses, the prices in Edmonton are going to be going up by about 2% this year. Um, they're expecting apartment vacancies to decline. So we're going to see a tighter rental market. And the Realtors Association of Edmonton is actually along the same line of thinking. They're thinking about 2%. Uh, growth for this year. 1% uh, in condos, which would hold true with what we've seen in the past years as well, just given the, the number of condos on the market. Um, me, what are my predictions? Well, I'm going to throw my hat in the ring. I like to do predictions too, but just for fun. I actually think that we might see um, the Edmund market outperform what both CMHC and the Realtors Association are calling for. And the reason is that I think they were tempering their predictions based on what was happening globally. And so my optimistic outlook is maybe we're going to see a growth of 4 to 5%. So only time will tell. We're going to put that in the time capsule and we'll see in a year's time what actually happened. Um, and now we're going to focus a little bit more on what has actually been happening. Now, the stats for December were actually quite interesting. They were a little bit off the chart. Uh, average prices in Edmonton actually shot up to 391,000 for single family dwellings. And this was very interesting because the prices actually went up and we're actually seeing a trend line going in an upward direction. Now, normally because of seasonal variations, the real estate market will kind of go up in the spring and then we actually will typically see a, a decline in winter months. So the fact that we're actually seeing on, on a long-term trend of actually going up is interesting and my question is if this is a statistical anomaly um, or if this trend is going to continue because median house prices were around $365,000 $365, which would actually indicate more of a stable market not an upward trend. So in the next coming months we're going to be watching those factors but nevertheless it is interesting that we're actually having a positive in the market rather than that negative. Um, condominium prices continue to stay stable. Uh, you know, they are following that seasonal curve where prices have come down from the from their highs earlier this year. And my other uh, observation is that total inventory is low. We're around 4,350 units right now. And this is typical during winter months, but it is lower than other years. So those are the two things we're going to keep watching in the coming months. We're going to be watching inventory and we're going to be seeing if that house price of December was an anomaly or if that's actually a trend. That's all for now. Please check our website at www.northernlightsappraisals.ca for more information. There's also our newsletter in print and that will give you further information as well. Thanks for watching and all the best in 2013.